Let's talk about five reasons to own your own home. Number one is security. When you own your own home, your payment will never go up. At least your principal and interest payment will never go up. Your payment, the part of your payment that includes insurance and taxes could go up or down depending on what happens with taxes and insurance in your area. When you rent, you're at the whim of the landlord or the property management company on what your rent is going to be, what your monthly payment is going to be. So owning your own home provides you some security of knowing exactly how much you need to budget to pay for your home. Number two is money. Yes, it's going to cost some money to get into a home. Could be $20,000 or more cash up front to buy a $300,000 home. However, you have an opportunity to get money from the seller in the form of concessions, what they will help pay toward your closing costs. You also have the potential to get money from the lender in forms of down payment assistance. It's not like you can walk up to somebody and knock on their door and say, hey, would you give me $7,000? However, you might be able to get that when you purchase a home. It's just all part of the deal. The number three reason you should consider buying a home is pride. It's your home. There's some pride in home ownership that comes from it being your place, which leads me to number four, which is going to be the opportunity to personalize it. You can customize your home to you. You may not be able to do that in an apartment or a rented place, but you can do what you want to. You have the potential to move walls. You have the potential to replace the entire bathroom or the kitchen or what trees you want to plant out in the yard. You have an opportunity to customize your own home, which could lead to even more pride in your home. And the number five reason you need to consider buying a home is building wealth. Every month that you make a payment, you're paying part of the principal, which goes toward the amount of money that you borrowed from the home of what it's worth. So if you have a principal payment of $200, you have that much equity built into the home. And over time, that compounds because the amount you pay every month increases from month to month going toward the equity. Plus, you have what the home appreciates in value. Let's say you bought a $300,000 home now and it appreciates 5% a year. That $300,000 house a year from now with a 5% appreciation would be worth $315,000. And another 5%, it wouldn't be $330,000 because you got to compound the 5% on top of the extra 15,000. It would be more than 330. When you do that over time, you're going to continue to build wealth for you and your family. I'm Jeff Jones of EXP Realty in MidSouth.Homes. You can discover if you're ready to buy a home by going to ReadyToBuyScore.com. Hey, remember to like this video and click the bell icon somewhere on the screen so that you can subscribe to my YouTube channel and be notified whenever new videos drop.